Hello everybody, Captain Thief April 21st actually. Daily Dungeon, please something quick. Dwarf Berserker and the Cursed Oasis. That's anything but quick actually. But, I have a plan. We're definitely going Benlor because we love Pissorf. That's the plan. It's going to be Berserker, but yeah, whatever. Um, I don't think we really need immunity to mana burn so much as I would like a dragon heart, actually. Uh, we're already prepping an altar. Let's not prep another. I don't work that way, alright? And mana boosters, I guess. The sword would help, but it doesn't help enough. Okay, so the bad thing about Berserker here is that, yeah, we have 50% magic resist, but guess what? Here, it almost doesn't matter at all because we get cursed all the time, which means no resistances have any effect. Yeah. Whatever, whatever. Uh, let's see. Oh, that helps immensely, actually. Thank you, Balance Dagger. Let's go ahead and consider going with Binlore in a minute. You know, once I have a better idea of what I'm doing here. Uh, Stone Sigil. I already bought that. You don't. You can't tell me to buy it again, Rail. Um, as for you, let's just go ahead and kill him. Right, once we level up, once we level up, we will go to the Cursed Oasis. Or where, what, the Cursed Plane, whatever you want to call it. And things won't be so good for us. Let's go ahead and just do that. Whoops. Well, I leveled up and now I'm in the Cursed Realm. Right? No, okay, well, that works for me. Let's see if we can find a level 2 real quick. Level 1's all abounds. Uh, we're finding the life-stealing jerks in the uh, Shadow Realm, whatever you want to call it. Let's just go ahead and take off one of his death protections. And let's just donate as much health as possible to these jerks that we can't even see yet. Yet. Don't worry, once we do it, it's not like they're particularly scary or anything. They're actually kind of easy. Alright, I think we may soon want to go with Binlor. Because I want to get behind there. And yes, as a berserker, this means we only get like... Two Pissorfs. Okay, that's not bad. Not great, though. Dwarf gets extra health from recycling stuff. So I could really be helping myself along with that. Um, let's see, what else? Who else are we looking for? Like a level three or something? Let's uh, break walls whenever we can. Uh, I kind of don't want to kill anybody, though. There we go. And we'll just put you there just for now. Uh, what do we want to buy? Probably the stone form or something. We definitely want to kill the main boss with this Pissorf, though. Yes. Okay, so we have level threes all over the place. Oh, this will help with our find equal level enemies thing. Uh-huh. Oh, right, I need a bit more MP for this. Uh, that's cool. I'll just go ahead and get cursed then. Why not? Um, ought I pick up the help my first? No. Why? Just don't feel like it. There's all the jerks. Alright. A little bit of punishment, but that's okay. Let's uh, go ahead and push another guy through another wall. And call it a day. There we go. There we go. Um, level threes. Level threes. I tell you what. Before we do that. I'm really sick of you stealing my health, guys. Let's go ahead and uh, smack him. And then we'll push him into a cursing plant. To take off another death protection. I probably could have gotten more if I was smarter about it. Oh well. And then we'll just finish him off. Good. That's one level three down. We can take out another one right there. So long as we don't lose a whole ton of our health to these life-stealing guys. Yes. Alright. Goodbye. Goodbye. And goodbye. Alright. Level three is not looking too terrible right now. Actually. But that's mostly because of the uh, balance dagger. Yeah. Um, now, since this is going to level us, I don't mind getting mana burned, but we're going to go ahead and piss off him twice and then smack him once. Level up. Hooray. Uh, let's push somebody else into a wall. Oh, that took us back. All right. That takes me back to a better time. The fire heart, I'll take it. We'll go ahead and charge it up a whole bunch. And we'll pull on level fours. When possible, anyway. Uh... Not a fan of things that meta burn me, to be honest. Martyr wraps are interesting, just probably not interesting enough. Is there another level four here that? Well, okay, that kind of counts. 
we'll let it count. It's good enough for two pushes. In fact, I don't even mind that he took off a whole bunch of... Yeah. Um, here, let's go ahead and save ourselves some time. Trouble. Money. Whatever. Pick up this knockback thingy. Boom. Two death protections in one go. And there's another. Let's go ahead and save a little bit of health. Now let's use the magic to push people into walls. That's the thing I should do. Oh yeah, getting cursed. Um... It might be a little dangerous to do this right now. But it's probably worth it. I would like the stone fist if at all possible. So maybe we'll save up for that first. Um, we're level 4. We should be fighting level 4s. Um, he's a little beyond me. Okay. Well, one reason why I'm glad I have this uh, bear mace is that when I knock them, it's going to knock them away and they're not going to be able to blink. So, it's perfect for me. Really. Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and... Well, once I kill him, I'm going to get out of this place. So let's go ahead and do that and then kill him. And then... I should be able to do this, I think. Let's go ahead and push him. And then push him. And I'll write the lifesteal. Shoot, okay, well that kind of changes things. And not in a good way. Guys, stop stop with lifesteal. It's, it's not cool, alright? It just isn't. Alright, I'm going to push you down. Just so I can push him over. Boom, like so. And like so. Alright. Now we can get the stone fist. Hooray. We don't have to have the bear mace anymore to push people. That's my plan anyway. Level fours. Four is the motorsport. I think I've said that before. Piercing one, great for here, but not right now, alright? Just not right now. This is gonna level us. And I think that's the boss. Yeah, that's the boss dragon. He curses on hit, making him impossible to beat because he'll just send us away as soon as that happens. Um, that's okay though. Is this a wall? No, it's not a wall. We're gonna level, and then we're gonna lose some piety and then get punished for it. Oh, here we go. I'll just push you first. There we go. Okay, now Ben Lord will take all our resistances, and I want to keep them for this fight. If we can hold on to them the entire way, this fight gets a lot easier. A lot easier. And thanks to the knockback, I'm killing him. See? Told you. Told you. Let's push him into another. In fact, let's push him into another. And now we're back out here again. If we have to, we might have to um, destroy an altar just for extra piety. In fact, we want, want to do that earlier. So that way we don't get punished for three levels. That would be actually fantastic if we could make that happen. Okay. One thing we can do is we can push him into this guy a whole bunch and then they'll both die. So this fight is already somewhat determined. Uh, i tell you what. Let's kill a level 1 cursor or get hurt by a cursor or something. That's something I want to do so I can go fight one of those level 5s. He doesn't curse, he doesn't curse. Looking for somebody more along the lines of this guy. So, you know, this is kind of bad practice but I'm going to go ahead and just let him hit me. There we go. And a level 5. The thing about him is if we smack him and he doesn't move, then he's uh, going to stay here. Or he's going to blink, actually, and that's not something we want to happen. We also have the fire heart. We should, really should be probably using that. Also, I want to keep these two here, but I also want to pull this guy in to do something. At least for one hit, maybe. Um... And then he won't blink away, that's why, if he's dizzy. No? No. Okay, let's pull him in with this one. Uh, I still have this kind of working for me. Well, no, I don't, actually. Not anymore. There's another one of those guys that I don't want to fight, by the way. Game. Okay, there we go. There's the level five. And I can smack him into him twice and win the day. But before we do... I'm going to waste some darkness on pointless stuff. Let's pull in. Okay, it's because he's dizzy. All right, well, fine. Um, let's go ahead and smack this guy twice, thus winning. That's good. 
And now this guy is a lot easier to fight, but, you know, as soon as we pick up any darkness, he's going to heal. It's going to suck. Uh, oh, hey, it's Dracul. Ah, uh, that's kind of a difficult decision. We don't really want to go with him because half the, or more than half the enemies here are undead. All the thralls, all the wraiths, all those guys are undead. We don't want any of that business. Um... Just considering my options here. We can also desecrate it, but then we'll lose 20 max health permanently. Which is not a good thing, except for the fact that uh, I can somewhat recover it. Due to the fact that I've been wearing this dragon heart the entire time I'm a dwarf. You know, we can kind of work our way around it. Eventually it just kind of sucks initially. But then we'll stop losing uh, Binlor Piety. Then again, why do I want, even want to stay with Binlor? That's the good question. Maybe we just want to leave as soon as we can. So that might be a thing I'll do. Um, we'll break some walls maybe, I guess, if possible. Okay. What I'm thinking about doing is I'm going to... Uh, I need him out of the way, actually. Why did I bring him down here? Um, ah, he's still mad at me. There we go. Finished his face. That's not going to level us. That's kind of a good thing. Kind of. Underscore, asterisk, kind of. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and smack him a bunch. Uh-huh. And then we're going to push him into him. And then we'll finish them both off at the same time. Um, didn't quite work out like I thought it would, but oh well. This should do it. Alright, found the boss. That's good. thing about this boss is that he... We're doing 14 per... Is he has a whole bunch of resists, which is bad. Bad for us. But thankfully, <clears throat> something we can do is we can just push an enemy into him a whole bunch and that will kind of work for us I'm thinking what we want to do is we want to fight this guy and get his death protections down a bit and then we can push him into him maybe because once his death protections are down we'll have a lot more we'll be able to take a lot more hits or something it'll just work out in the meantime we should probably be careful about how we do this. Smack him. Two Pistorfs. Is it worth it? I'll just take the health. Downgrade. Thanks. And I can push these curse plants into uh, walls too. Like so. Yeah, it cursed me again. So we really should be watching out for that. In fact, I probably won't be fighting this other level 6 because uh, the curses, curses are too much. They become too much for me. Okay, so let's just go ahead and do this. Uh, we're going to be mana burned, but that's okay. That's all right with me, I, I guess. I'm going to bring it back. And I need to break another wall so I'm not punished next time because I want to keep this magic resist we got going. Um, I can find an enemy right next to a wall. That would be great. Oh, I'm poisoned too. Of course, of course. Why wouldn't I be? Walls, please. Well, I hate having to do this twice, but okay. I'll pull it off. I don't think that cursed me, actually. Well, maybe it did. Alright. So, here's what we're going to do. Let's just go ahead and... Uh, I just... I'm not going to be able to have the magic just while fighting him, because I'm going to be fighting him in this realm, whatever. So that plan is somewhat out. Just thinking. Okay. So. Hmm. I actually want to leave this place now, but I'm too cursed to do it. What I'm thinking is I want to pick up 
as much magic as possible. Push him into him. That's going to do it twice. But only twice. That's not good enough. Doing 115. That's not fair. <sighs> My other option is I can just go ahead and kill the low level enemies here that I can. And escape at least. So I think I'm going to have to do that. Yep. That's something I'll do. Particularly these low-level wraiths, because uh, this is the only chance I get to kill them ever. And thankfully I am uh, 1 EXP away. Okay, let's pick up all our potions. We don't never know when we might not get to use them again. All of them, please. Thank you. Alright. So now this guy is hitting us a lot less harder. Thankfully. Um... Want to fight? I'm done with you. Let's just get the max health out of it. Fireheart, that's going to be great. We'll uh, work on that in a minute. I... You know what? Let's use the blood to power. That's probably the smarter thing to do. I still don't see the third altar, whatever it is. I'm going to pick up this excess piety just because. Just uh, it didn't get us to the non-punishable zone just yet. I don't want to let me see though. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. So we can just push him a whole bunch into that guy and eventually kill him, I think. I think that'll probably be what works. Alright, um, what else are we doing? Grabbing this. Anything we need to buy? Water wraps, not a bad idea, but not a great idea either. We don't need any potions from here, actually. Maybe the Schadenfreude, we'll see. I might just be saving it for the whip ass for him. That seems like the best plan. Uh, let's get some mana. We can also grab the mana later, so you know what? Let's just go ahead and smack him and get back to this place. Okay. I feel a little bit better about how this is going. A little bit. Alright, one thing I kind of want to do is I kind of want to, you know, Smack him just to get rid of some of that overhealth. Because, you know, once I heal up, he's not going to get that overhealth back. I know, pretty sneaky, isn't it? Okay, so. Oh, I recycled the blood to power. I didn't mean to do that. Actually. Uh, whatever. Just whatever. Um, let's just get into it. Okay, so we're going to piss off him a whole bunch into the enemy. I feel like that's the thing to do. Just keep on doing it. Uh, if we had a bit more. If we had a bit more going for us. Uh, we do, actually, because we can just level up Catapult. Sort of. Alright, we didn't lose our Rezus. Alright. Um, push him again. And again. And again, heal up, and again, it's losing damage, again, no, it's Fireheart, and again, oh, uh, hang on, I need to get back there, uh, please send me back, is there, yeah, there's a, there's a health potion, that's good, okay, send me back, please, alright, can we kill him in one hit, yeah, so let's do it. Okay, oh, and now that we're back here again, the, the Dragon Soul's on the ground back in the place and we need to go back and pick it up. So, uh, give me a second again. Um, send me back, please. Thank you. Alright, there it is. There it is. Free Dragon Soul. Good enough for me. Um, we're almost leveled up, too. I'm proud of that accomplishment. Okay, so now we're just fighting him. Uh, if we can get rid of this curse... Then we'll be just fine. In fact, I would really like it if we can find like a level 2 or something. Might have to be this guy with uh, Burned Raz. Oh, we didn't recycle the blood to power. Well, alright then. I'm trying to think of what we're probably going to end up doing. Um, how on earth can we... Oh, right, this... Keg O Health. Let's just go ahead and use it. Let's go ahead and use it. <clears throat> Are there any items that I missed? 
took missed something. I don't really need the piss off as much anymore. But on the other hand, there's not nearly enough walls to break to get out of Benlor's terribleness. I mean, he's alright. Just, you know, how I feel about this. Okay, we picked up the burned uh Is there a way for me to get rid of Curse uh, some other way? Is it going to hurt anyone's feelings if I discover this? It didn't hurt my feelings, and that's all that matters. Anybody down here? No. But I will pick this up. In fact, I might come back for the other stuff, too. It might be helpful. Just might be helpful. Okay, so... I can burn you. And then finish you off in one hit. That's good. That's really good. Um, I want to get rid of the curse, because the magic resist helps a ton. Alright, so... Tell you what, let's just piss off him a whole bunch. You know, that doesn't really do too much. And we're going to level and it's going to curse us again, isn't it? Yeah, it is. See, there it is. There it was. This is frustrating, to say the least, guys. Um, He's level 8, I'm level 8. I, I don't want to. The other option is to just try and burn him to death. I don't know. I guess this is one of the only ways. Alright, thank you, Dragon Soul. And then we'll kill him. Now it's, we're uncursed. Okay, that, that helps a ton. We're... He retaliates Fireball, by the way, so don't really want to get rid of... Pissorf. That might be our only source of damage. And the Bear Mace is doing wonders too. We're just going to keep knocking him back into the dragon for some extra damage, I guess. Um, so, what are we getting rid of to get these two things? Probably nothing. Okay, well, fine. Two can play at that game. Uh, let's go ahead and just uh, fight this guy then. Yes. 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 Drink of it health potion because you know I'm not with glowing garden or anything and then uh, finish them off all right that's how it is done um and I just ran out of space it looks like awesome yeah I I don't know what to say either um I'm gonna have to see where it cut out let's just exit though take my word for it I won said I beat it in 21 minutes 43 seconds and uh, there's nobody else on the leaderboard okay um, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, kind of a weird place for it to run out of room, though. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, this has been, or rather, at the end, not watching. Uh, this has been Captain Thief playing Desktop Dungeons, and I will see you in the next one.